Nefesh. This is week three of our explorations of the various Firot that are from the beginning of Passover to the end of Shavuot. And week three, Tiferet, which we understand for, as meaning compassion from the Midah of Rachamim, is actually not a Sefirah that stands on its own as a building block for the universe, but it's actually the integration of two Sefirot that Rabbi Susan and Rabbi Aaron have already talked about, which are Chesed, which is unbridled generosity, and Gvurah, boundaries, discipline. And what does that mean that they're an integration of the two? Well, let me talk about it from the perspective of someone who has either been in a work situation or as a parent has always had to consider how do you either go from a place of being very strict and rigid and creating rules to looseness, but dealing with the chaos or the inconsistencies that come with not having any structure or having the narrowness of success that comes with rigidity. What we have with compassion is something that doesn't draw from within. Generosity and gvura boundaries are something that we're in here trying to find. I am being kind to somebody else because it makes me feel right. I am creating structure because it helps me feel better to have boundaries and rules because I have predictability. But compassion is actually something you have to create from the outside. It really relies on being connected to other individuals. So in really thinking about how can we bring compassion into our lives, think it from the same way you would want a parent to think about it, or a boss, or someone else. You want them to consider, how can I connect with other people? So the first thing is, is really looking for opportunities for dialogue. Then thinking about how can I really have empathy for people? How can I understand where they're coming from? And third is how do you really find the opportunities to connect and to really get to know them? That's where empathy comes from. It comes from reaching outside of you and wanting to connect someone outside of you. At Nefesh and at Macomb, where I get to work with amazing kids, we always are encouraging our teachers not just to find ways to connect with kids because they want to feel good about it. They want chesed or they want to create boundaries because they want to make sure the kids behave a certain way so that they can do their lesson. But we actually want them to listen to the kids, to hear from the kids, to react to what the kids are telling them. And then with that compassion, they can bring growth. And so for this week, think about how you can bring that kind of listening, that kind of re reacting to what somebody else is bringing you to have compassion in your life. And that will bring you T-Ferret.